Hey guys, in this tutorial we are going to talk about how to design a shear ball using section designer in Etab's software. Okay? Let's start. Here is a model. We given all other specifications only I will just want to design a shear ball using section designer. Okay? I will go to the plan view. Okay, you can see here I have left this uh, this piece for a core shear walls. Okay, I will just go here to the draw. After that, I will select draw wall stack shear wall section. Okay, and after that, we have many different wall stacks. We can select each and every. Uh, uh, shear wall sections whatever you want but for uh, for this tutorial I want to be uh, I want the core, the core shear wall to be in this type ok I will just select and adjust some changes in layout ok and I will make some changes here for example I want that core width in the x directions in these directions to be 3 meter ok after that ok after you can see here the lx length will automatically be adjusted and I want the ly and l2 l1 and l2 ly2 to be 3.3 .3 meter and I want the core number to be 2 you can change here 3 4 ok and others but at the moment I want the core number to be 2 ok in uniform width I will select yes because I want the thickness of the shear walls to be same for all the walls but if you want to change that uh, you want that my uh, shear wall thickness will be different so you can select no after that you can change here the thickness uh, the, the shear wall thickness as well okay for now I want that shear wall thickness to be 300 millimeter okay for all the walls all the shear walls okay and coming to the openings dimension I want the opening height to be 2 meter okay and the opening width to be 1.3 meter okay you can see here we have opening width to be 1.3 meter okay and we have two cores and the wall thickness is 3 millimeter which is similar for all the shear walls okay after that press okay and i will place the core shear wall over here Okay, here and press escape. We can look that the core shear walls has been applied for whole building. Okay, because I have selected all stories to be applied as shear walls. After that, we are going to provide the reinforcement and, uh, and make some other uh, changes which is required for the shear wall designing. So I am coming here, the shear wall design section, press here, and after, after that, define general pier sections, and modify show pier section, section designer, because our main purpose is that to use section designer for shear wall designing okay here is the shear wall layout which we already given over here for this uh, structure so these are the openings and this is the course and this is the wall thickness and the reinforcement has been placed okay so like we can change bring other changes as well 
for example I will click here so I see here the rebar size I can change here I want to be now 14 millimeters but you can change 12 millimeters 14 millimeters whatever you want you can change here okay and I want the maximum spacing to be this much you can change 150 millimeters or 150 millimeters and others okay and you can select apply to all edges but I recommend that it is not uh, very uh, very uh, suitable for this kind of uh, share wall layout because we have different lengths of each and every uh, peer leg so the reinforcement is not is not suitable to be applied for all legs because the rebars will be varying in each and every side so I recommend that that you change and edit each and every uh, every age reinforcement uh, individually not as applied for all legs okay so I make this change in correction and this I like I want 14 millimeters and others okay for corners as well like I will select this corner this one this is the corner rebar size is 14 millimeters and area is this much okay you can change it adjust but this reinforcement I was already provided before so I think this reinforcement is is a very fit for this kind of shear wall design okay after that I will press okay after that I will check the interaction surface I will click this portion so this is the interaction curve for uh, for this shear wall uh, pier sections okay for core shear wall I will just select this one and copy copy current curve okay and I will place for Excel I will just open an Excel sheet this one and I will paste here so after that you I can draw the interaction curve here in the Excel sheet this is the axial force and this is momentum 2 this is momentum 3 okay and we can also see and look to the show fiber model data as well this is the data for fibers okay and I will check now moment curvature curve here this is the moment curvature curve I can show it is stable Okay, this is the moment curvature table I will just export to the Excel Microsoft Excel sheet I will press this one okay it will automatically transfer and export to the Excel sheet okay this is the moment curvature uh, specifications and other things moment and curvatures and after that I will, I will draw here for uh, in Excel sheet okay for further designing purpose okay I will just press here now I have already taken the uh, taken the information about interaction surface moment curvature and I have placed the reinforcement rebars still reinforcement which was required for each and every peer leg after that I will just press ok ok and ok ok Okay, now I want to apply that that shear wall section to this shear walls where I have given the reinforcement. Now I will select here, go to the object type, walls, select, close, and apply. Okay, assign general reinforcement. Here I will assign the reinforcement here, here. The design reinforcement to be checked. I should click here. Click this one. Reinforcement to be checked. After that, OK. Now the reinforcement has been applied for this whole shear walls. OK. Yeah. 
we have designed the sheer walls and also we given the reinforcement and other things. Thank you so much for your attention. I hope this lecture will help you and do not forget to like and subscribe this channel and if you have any questions in doubt please write it down in the comment section so I will try to answer as soon as possible. Have a good time.